My name is Paul Ingeth. I'm a meteorologist with the National Weather Service in Phoenix. I'm here tonight. We're with the uh, Skywarn program. The Skywarn program is the eyes for the National Weather Service on the ground. With all the great technology that we have in the office, such as satellite and radar, it doesn't allow us to truly see what's happening at the ground. And that's where the Skywarn spotters come in. Folks across the county, across the city, and across the state can serve as our eyes on the ground to alert, alert the National Weather Service and let us know what's going on. We may see on our radar that a storm looks severe, is possibly producing damaging winds, large hail, possibly even a tornado, but we don't truly know what's happening at the ground. Our Skywarn spotters can call our office and let us know what exactly is happening. It's an invaluable service for us. And we offer training mainly in the spring to cover these hazards. The training that we provide goes over what hazards we're looking for specifically, such as what size hail, what kind of winds we're looking for, tornadoes, et cetera. And we go over the specifics of what those are, what are the signs to look for, and kind of some general uh, weather safety uh, that goes along with living in Arizona. The big weather that we, uh, we get a lot here uh, is uh, hail, damaging winds, and also flash flooding, heavy rainfall. On a rare occasion, we'll get a tornado. Our Skywarn program that we have in Arizona is quite active. When we have severe weather ongoing, we do get a high number of reports. Sometimes for big weather events, it can be on the order of 100, maybe upwards of 200 through a, through a night. So we are getting a lot of these reports coming in. So people that are taking the training are participating and letting us know when this severe weather is occurring at the ground. Our attendance can vary quite a bit. Sometimes we'll have as few as five or 10 people. Sometimes we'll have 100 people filling up a room. The ten, it can vary quite a bit. We'll see people from all different walks of life. A lot of people are just average uh, John and Jane.